Roswell Flight Test Crew here at the Inner Drone Expo 2017, and I'm here with Kevin Howitt from the Brother Corporation. How are you doing, Kevin? Hey, Patrick. Very well. Doing well. <laughs> and what is this incredibly cool thing I've got on my face? Okay, so this is the Air Scouter WD-300C. It's a head-mounted display from Brother, and yes, we are the printer company. You have the ability to see what your drone's seeing in first-person view, but you're not losing a visual line of sight. Very cool. Now, I have to say that the video inside here is really crisp and clear, mm -hmm. and I wear reading glasses normally, so I can't normally read things an inch off my face. What do we got going on here? Sure. Well, so we've got in here on the headset a, um, a small 720p screen. We've also got a diopter. We've got some, some great custom optics from Brothers Engineering team, and you can actually adjust that from 12 inches up to infinity. So that's great in two reasons. One, like yourself, everyone's eyesight's a little different. If I'm looking at the screen and then looking out to the drone, then to the screen, then out to the drone, my eye is going to get tired very quickly. If I set this um, focus so it's far out there, I'm minimizing my eye strain, making a, a more comfortable flying experience. Okay, so next up, how do I get the signal from my drone into this eyepiece? Sure, it's really easy. So this is the uh, control box. So you notice there's two plugs in here. One's an HDMI plug. So in this case, we've got a Phantom 3 HDMI module going the mini HDMI out right to the uh, full-size HDMI here. So anything that can output a 720p HDMI signal, it's just plug and play. As far as power, it's powered by micro USB here. So any of the same batteries you might use for your cell phone. This is a 3350 milliamp hour battery I bought from a popular e-commerce site. Uh, this will power the air scatter for about five hours. And if it runs dead, you got another one. Exactly, you just swap it out. It's very easy. What other features should folks be aware of? Sure, I think one of the, the, the key things for the air scatter is adjustability. I favor the left eye, Patrick favors his right eye, but it actually comes with two different arms, so the same air scatter can be used if you're right or left eye dominant. Or heck, you could even switch it. It probably takes about a minute to swap that out. The eyepiece here is IP54 rated. It's water and dust resistant. I think they call that splash proof. We got some adjustable brightness settings in the control box, which makes it nice if you're shooting out in the sunlight. Because your screen's inside here, you're not worrying about blacking out the LCD the same way you would with, say, the, the uh, tablet on your controller. And if you're really worried about light leaking in around your eye, we've got a very advanced solution for, uh, for eye cups. <laughs> a simple baseball cap that'll cover probably 95% of the glare there. All right, so the final question everyone wants to know is what's it going to cost and when's it going to be available? Brother Air Scatter WD-300C, we're targeting a November for availability. And we're still finalizing pricing, but I would say somewhere in the $750 to $850 price range. Yeah, we'll set out some more information once that's finalized, you know, everyone who's come to our booth here. And uh, that, of course, will include uh, you guys. Well, fantastic. Well, I've been looking since day one, since the first time I flew FPV, I've been looking for a solution like this. So I'm certainly looking forward to it. Kevin, thanks so much. Thank you, Patrick. I can't wait to see what you guys can do with it, too. <laughs> All right. And from the Interdrone Expo 2017, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew signing off. Thanks again, Kevin. <laughs> Thank you.